There was a lot of anger, a lot of frustration inside that airport commissioner's meeting where many residents, they went to extreme lengths to make their case. An aerial warfare involving a toxic highway. That's what many San Fernando Valley residents who packed this Burbank Airport Commissioner's meeting say they're engaged in. My backyard has become like a war zone. A contentious fight involving the congested airspace from the high volume of planes departing daily from Burbank Airport. The numerous jets flying at low altitudes over homes and communities has triggered noise, health, and environmental concerns. This property owner played a recording for board members during public statements, the first time the issue of community noise concerns was added to the agenda, detailing how the drastic shift in flight patterns over the years has destroyed his quality of life. This is in our backyard. Other residents provided KTLA with cell phone video of low-flying airplanes over schools and houses as they made their case to commissioners to, quote, stop the jet superhighway in the skies and limit the air traffic. The board hired an independent contractor whose report revealed an increase in noise levels in parts of Studio City and Sherman Oaks. The Federal Aviation Administration is also conducting an environmental assessment of the proposed flight path changes to measure the actual impacts and find, quote, reasonable alternatives. The last week, the regional director for the Western Pacific uh, area of, of the FAA sent a letter to Senators Feinstein and Harris saying that the FAA is aware of the residents' concern but states that this accelerated approach is not the case. But some San Fernando Valley residents like Scott Newman, who is unbothered by the noise levels, say it's a reality of living in a highly populated area. If the flight plans get moved out of this neighborhood, it's going to get moved out of, it's moved to another neighborhood, and so you're going to fly out of where? East of here, where? San Fernando or Pacoima, and uh, it's, it's, it's going to be a problem for another neighborhood. Back inside that intense commissioner's meeting, where many emotionally described how the exhaust from the jets are reportedly making them sick. It's, it's affecting our daily life. Some beg the board to put pressure on the FAA to implement changes to flight paths, calling it a matter of survival. Please, please, please help me. Help me and my family. Please. You're killing me, honestly. This decision by the FAA on how to potentially resolve this issue won't come overnight. Until then, many residents and groups like Uproar LA, they vowed to keep this fight at the forefront. In Burbank, Kareen Winter, KTLA 5 News.